Hello, in this video I'm going to show you how to factory reset your iPad mini 7th generation without the password. So if you are actually stuck in the screen lock and you don't remember the passcode, then of course you might need to perform the factory reset in order to get the access back. And in order to do that, you will need to use the USB cable and you need to perform the factory reset by using the recovery mode. In order to do the recovery mode, or actually go to the recovery mode, and perform the factory reset, you will need the USB cable, you need to connect your iPad to your computer, whether it is Windows PC, laptop or MacBook. Then on the computer you also need to have iTunes. If you are on Windows you need to download iTunes from, for instance, Microsoft Store. And then once you connect the USB cable to the iPad, what you need to do is lock, not lock, sorry, uh, perform the uh, short combination of buttons. You need to use a shortcut that allows you to turn off the device and go to the factory, uh, sorry, not factory, to the recovery mode. Now, in order to do that, you need to use the volume up button and then you need to press and quickly release it. Then you need to do the same thing with volume down and then press and hold the top button or power button. So let me demonstrate. Press volume up, volume down, and then press and hold the power button or top button. And you need to keep holding this button until you actually are in the recovery mode. So first the screen will turn off just like it did right now. Then we will see the Apple logo, but keep holding the power button all the time. And now we should see the recovery mode. There we go. So this is the recovery mode. And now on your computer on iTunes, you will have the option to do the factory reset, to remove everything from your device and get your access back. Of course, if you have a backup on iCloud, etc., you will get those files back, but whatever is on this iPad that you didn't back up, unfortunately, will be gone. And this is how we can do the factory reset without using settings, but using the recovery mode. And that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching, leave a like and subscribe to my channel and see you in my next videos. Bye!